Hey everyone, this is Kingpin PKR 316. I hope everybody had a nice Christmas and a good holiday. Um, the way I get my book set up, I, I didn't get any for three weeks, so that's why I didn't make a video. But I have some other stuff and uh, some statues, and so let's get into it. Um, this is Amazing Spider-Man 194. Um, I'm pretty happy with this. I actually have to, I was mentioned about doing grading videos, and this is one of the books I'm going to pick. Because this is in really nice shape. Um, I got it off eBay. Um, first appearance of the Black Cat. So that's a, uh, I was pretty happy to get that. Knock that off my list of amazing, amazing Spider-Man books to get. This is Guardians of the Galaxy. This is annual number one. A lot of these annuals are hit and miss. They don't actually have anything to do with the continuity of the story. I, I really didn't uh, like it that much. I, I wasn't into it. Um, this is Green Arrow number 37. This is also, now that they've changed the team and they've gotten more into it being like Arrow than Green Arrow, I don't know, I haven't liked it as much. I'm going to stick with it, but uh, I'm a little disappointed in the direction that they've been taking with this book. This is Punisher. This is number 13. This is actually a Howling Commandos. Punisher's not even really in this that much. It's more of a, a Howling Commandos. I don't know if I'd call it an origin, but it's a Howling Commandos story of how they came together to start looking for the Punisher in this book. This is Hulk number nine. This is the second part of the Kitty Pride story. Uh, it's I, I like Kitty Pride. I, I thought it was a pretty good book. I um. <clears throat> Definitely not my favorite. I, I don't really, because right now he's kind of like Banner in there, where he's really smart, and um, they call him Doc Green. And he has Banner's brains, but he walks around like the Hulk. So uh, I'm willing to see where it goes, though. This is Axis number seven. I don't know how many people are reading this. I, I like the story. I think it's pretty good. I think it's a cool idea where the... um where the bad guys get together and they're almost like they're the good guys and we'll see where this breaks out after this. I got 8 and 9 over there so I'm looking forward to reading that. This is Carnage Part 3. Is, is this Part 3? Yeah, this is the, the last part of this. This was a good story. I like this a lot. It's cool how he's like uh, being a bad, how he's being a good guy and it's funny the girl that he's helping in this turns on him so it's it's funny that he's trying to be a good guy and the uh, and the person who he was saving turns on him this is Thor number three this is an awesome story um, on the last page of this uh, you see Thor comes back and this is uh, Malekith the Dark Elves and the Frost Giants are in this and this is a uh, I'm really enjoying this I, I like Thor being a girl. I thought they did an excellent job with this so far. This is Detective Comics 37. I, uh... I'm not a big fan of Anarchy. I don't, uh... But I, I get all the Detective Comics. I, I, and I don't like the artwork that much in this. Suicide Squad I'm really enjoying. I think this is a really good book. I, I like it a lot. They, um... Where are they right now? You know, I forget where they are right now. I believe they were just in Russia because Deathstroke, uh, Deathstroke double-crossed them. And I believe Deadshot's in a wheelchair. And Black Manta is the leader, and they're still going on missions. I forget where they're going next. I thought they were going to China next. Batman Eternal. This is 35. Still good story. I'm waiting to see how this finishes up. This is 36. Uh, this is Justice League 36, the Amazon virus. This is a good story. Where uh, I think they're about to go after Lex Luthor. Angela, Asgard's assassin, number one. I like the book. The artwork is terrific. I'm willing to see where it goes. I'm going to give it three or four issues. I, I, you know, I, I thought it was decent for a first issue, but I wasn't like, oh my god, wow, this is sick. But the the artwork is really good. Spider-Man X-Men number one. I, I just got it because, <clears throat> excuse me, Spider-Man and X-Men are two of my favorite characters in, in the Marvel Universe. 
and uh, I, I didn't like it. I dropped it already. I'm not. I got the first issue. I really didn't see where it's like. Uh, Spider Man's a professor at the Xavier School. I, I didn't like it. Uh, I'm waiting for this to end. This is the Spider Verse. I'm not really into this. I just get it because I get all the amazing Spider Mans. This is the variant for that cover. This is annual number one. Also, <clears throat> didn't have too much to do with the, the continuity of anything that's going on in there. I, I didn't like it. This is the, the variant for that. I got the variant. Cool cover, but I, I didn't care for the story. Another story I didn't care for. This is annual. You, you get stuck with a lot of these annuals when... Um, when it's a five week you know it's the end of the year so and it's also a five week month so really good story i i've been enjoying inhuman a lot i got a bunch of them i got six i think this is seven but really looking forward to see where this goes eight and there's number nine okay bear with me for a second well, I'm going to have a lot of books to put away when I finally uh, start doing this. Okay, more books. These are newer books. This is Supergirl number 37. I actually read these last night. This is part two of The Crucible. It's a school where uh, they kind of... I guess you'd say they um, they see where they could take their powers, where they, they, they try to make it more than just being Supergirl. They, they try to expand on you know what her knowledge and just different things she can do, like really... Uh, seeing the potential of all their powers, like there's other people in, involved in this that are um, that have other powers as well. She um, she befriends a girl named Maxima, who they go through and they they take classes together and they do missions and stuff. Now uh, there's a guy in there that's a, I guess he's a beast-like character. His name's Savo, and his homeworld is being invaded. Well, I, it's not invaded. It would um. His brother is taking over the throne of his mother, of Savo's mother and father, the the king and the queen. So Supergirl and her group of friends have to go to this guy's homeworld and help out. So we'll see where that goes. Uh, Wonder Woman 37. I, I really didn't like this book. It was kind of a quick read, too. Um... On the last page, they kind of sucked me in, though, by their... their they're uh, resurrecting Donna Troy, so I, I was kind of interested in that. But I, I think I'm I'm very close to dropping this book. Superman 37, also another book that I'm kind of sticking around because it's Jeff Johns, and I want to see where it goes. I, I want to give him a shot to to really like this because I want to like the Superman book, but I'm just I'm not I'm not digging this at all. This is the Darwin Cook Batman cover. I didn't get too many of these. I'm trying to cut out some of the variants or I'm going to have a, a box of comics with like, you know, 10,000 books in it after not too long. So I'm, I'm trying to uh, cut back on all the, like getting all the variants and different stuff like that. But <clears throat> I get all the Batman books, so this is the one I, I picked to get. This is a pretty cool variant. This is Endgame Part 3. Cool Joker cover. This is the variant for that. This is the 1 in 25 variant for for that Batman book. This is uh, Robin Rises Alpha. Good story. Uh, continues with uh, resurrecting Robin from the dead. And he's got powers and stuff like that. I really enjoyed this. Peter J. Tomasi does this. This is also, this was an awesome book. Can't uh, say enough about this book. This was great. Really good book. Uh, I love him fighting Darkseid and, and going through the um, the boom tube and, and getting back. And then Calabac follows them back through the boom tube. And it's just it's a really good story. Peter J. Tomasi does a great job on this book. Okay, now I'm going to get into some of the... Some of the statues. <clears throat> this is a... Uh, Kota Bikia artifacts. I haven't opened any of these yet. Oh, I'll show them more when I open them. I don't have any place to put them, actually. The, this is the green arrow. I'm still waiting for my arrow statue. 
but uh, this is the green arrow one. They got the little magnet base on it, so that'll be cool to set up. Uh, this I got. This is the the Dick Sprang Joker. This is the black and white. I love the black and white statues. I've been getting these for a while. So this is like the the '40s inspired Joker, and I couldn't get that without getting reaching over here and. Here's Batman, also the the Dick Sprang inspired, so I couldn't get one without getting the other. So those are pretty cool. You see the Joker, I really like the Joker. He's holding the card, and there's Batman, these are the different, see, it'll go around the box. I want to get one of those spinner things for when I take these out and I can show people and see that's what the statue looks like. There's the Joker, and that's what the Joker looks like. Okay, um, now, this is, I try not to go over 10 minutes in these videos, so, this is the Michael Turner, this is the Michael Turner, uh, black and white statue, so that was pretty cool, I was happy to get this, they all came in at once, it's funny, I don't get any for months, and then they all came in at once, so, that's the back of that, and there's the, the long shot of it, so that's pretty cool, so that's the Michael Turner cover, now, this I also got, which is uh, a four-pack of figures, which is the Arkham Origins, Batman, Joker, Deadshot, uh, not Deadshot, Deathstroke, and Black Mask. So I thought that was pretty cool. This is, I don't know exactly where I'm going to display this yet. But the the figures are really in, in detail, so I, uh... Well, that's all I uh, that's all I got for now. When I read more books and get some other stuff, I, I have a whole still whole a book to read. So I'll I'll make another video. I don't like making twenty minute videos. So well, everybody, uh, I hope you have a nice rest of your weekend. This is Kingpin PKR three one six. See ya.